Greetings Voyagers Now for another one of my soon to be world famous one take smartphone videos from the road Back at the campsite here in Teton Forest uh, There's a bronze plaque over there that I have on video But I wanted to show you something I want to we took a walk down the road this morning and uh you know, I'm still recovering from that hip replacement surgery, so there's only so far I can go before it starts to hurt. So we turned around and came back. But there was a spot down there that I really, really want to video. And uh, my battery was dead. My, I ran the battery out on my uh, camcorder. And, uh, and I also didn't have my tripod with me. I want to do a time lapse. So we came, we walked back to the van, and uh, I've had the motor running on the van for about half hour, and uh, I have my uh, handy cam, my handy cam, my camcorder, my Canon Vixia, plugged into the uh, power inverter, running off the uh, off the alternator. So I've got just enough minutes recharged on the camcorder, camcorder, so that I can go down and do the. Uh, the time lapse that I want to do. It's very windy here, um, so I'm uh, <laughs> I'm hunkering down on the lee side of the van because otherwise you'll never hear me. But uh, we have to leave the campsite because I got the battery charged and I want to go down and photograph that scene. But I, I'm really not up to walk on that all that far down and back again. So we're going to drive. But it's Friday. It's Friday afternoon. And, uh, you know, people are going to be looking for campsites. So if I leave this campsite, we might not have it when we get back. But you can legally leave like a tent or your belongings at the campsite and then take off. And it's still, and it's still yours. Um, if you leave and you don't leave anything behind, someone can legally take it. So I had to buy a pair of uh, sawhorses plastic saw horses when I was in Denver so I could cut the sheets and the panels um, of plywood for building out the van oh look you won't be able to see it but there's a couple of raptors flying around up there there's another one over there oh man uh, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna have to see what I can do and I've seen them before I'm gonna have to see what I can do about uh, getting the camcorder up on the uh, on the tripod and See what I can do. It's beautiful. It's wonderful to watch them soaring on the wind because the wind is really strong. They don't have to flap their wings at all. It's incredible. Beautiful animals. Anyway, so I had to buy these saw horses and, uh, and it was a pain in the neck. Um, they're $40. They're all plastic. I debated about whether I should just toss them when I leave them because they take up a lot of space in the van, floor space, and it's kind of at a premium and they're getting in the way. And but now I found a use for them on the road, as you will see. Yeah, we are about to leave the campsite to go do some video, and so I barricaded the way in and. So unless somebody is just a complete dumbbell, they'll realize that this site is taken and they'll move on. Hopefully. The adventure continues. Thanks for watching. Tune in again soon. More smartphone videos on the way as soon as I can find some of my internet service so <laughs> I can upload with. Uh, I got a few of them coming. So uh, I'll catch you later. Peace and out.